Oh, that noise. I don't like. I am a weird. Why am I opening this? I'm actually scared. I I I thought I already played through this game once. I wouldn't be scared, but I never played this game with headphones or good headphones, and now I have better headphones than when I first played through this game, and it's it's scary. I don't want to play anymore. I'm scared. Hisoka, this game is scary. Also, I'm a weirdo, and I am super sensitive to noise. The camera obscura will react to items that are normally hidden from the eyes of the living. You can bring these items back in. You can bring those items back to this world by f f photographing, photographing the place where they were taken from with the correct angle and position. Wait, tilt. So, th this way. This way. No. Th I do not. Focus on item with a uh, hold. Wait, focus. Oh, 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 it doesn't. Oh, okay, I see, I see. It used to just lock into place when you were like at the right angle. Now I have to actually look at it. I actually have to see it. I don't want to see it. She actually said we shouldn't we should leave before it gets dark. Oh, okay. Well, never mind. I'll sh I'll sh shut my mouth. <laughs> I tried to play this game. He's so good. I saw that. I saw that glit glit glit. Texture. I tried to play this game way back when, trying to learn Japanese, which isn't actually a good idea because everything. He's so good. He's so good. He's so good. I missed again. He's so good. Oh, I keep missing all my points, <laughs> which isn't actually a very good idea because yes. Wait, wait, don't leave me. Wait, 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 Never mind. Okay. Wow, you teleported fast. But anyway, I was saying something. <laughs> oh, I tried to use this game to learn Japanese. Not a good idea. Everything's written in old Japanese. Bro, oh, I knew you were there. I still missed. Oh, I missed every single easy ghost. Oh, I thought that was a herb. That's the wrong game. I'm not playing Resident Evil. Uh, I knew he was there and I still missed him. I'm so sad. He's so good. Come back! Yes, take my camera. This is why you should always bring your phone with you, children. To take pictures of those so they don't drown you, apparently. Bro, I got more film where that came from. Okay. Hey! Uh, oh wait, no, I have to get that fatal frame, don't I? Ah! Go, go, 
up the photograph a ghost weak point to deal damage to them. The capture area is your area of attack. You cannot take the photos if you're out of film. Ghosts take damage. After a time, they are reabsorbed. Photograph the fragments before that happens. When five or more targets are in view, take a photograph. Taking a photograph will knock back the ghost. The capture area will go red during shutter chance. Keep adjusting your position so that you have at least five targets, including ghosts and spirit fragments, in view to sh trigger shutter chance. Let's get you. Whoa. Like, oh, ah, there you go. That will never ever happen again. That took a, a lot of of thinking. When the capture area flashes red as a ghost is attacking, you can take a fatal frame shot. You need to capture the ghost mid attack. Apart from a knockback effect, fatal frame shots trigger fatal time when you can take photos in close succession without using film. Fatal frame shots are very useful when spirits are too close to you to trigger shutter chance. <laughs> Aw man, I ran out. <laughs> I can never get more than like two fatal shots. Camera Obscura only has an effect on ghosts within a specific range. Ghosts that are too far away will not take any damage. The bigger the target, the more damage the camera will deal. Get closer to ghosts for more powerful shots. Oh, what? Am I close enough? Oh, ah, ah! Am I fighting for reals? Where are you? Where'd you go? Oh, I scared! I scared! I don't know where the ghost is! Where are you? Are you? Oh, okay, I see you now. Bruh. Oh. <gasps> I was brave for a second and then you glitched through and I was like, no, let's not. Ugh. Go away. Where are you? Where? 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 <laughs> He's here. <laughs> He's. Oh, I see him. I don't see him anymore. I. Where are you? There you are. Can I? No, go away. No! Can you die yet? Oh, he's dead, right? It said overkill. Okay, good. <sighs> Fighting ghosts are stressful, man. Oh, don't they leave like a spirit trace thingy or something? Oh, I guess they don't explain it to here. Yuri, why are you so wet? How did Hisoka... Where were you during this whole time? I did play through this game a long ass time ago and I can't remember any of the story bits.
の先生先ほど黒沢さんがいらっしゃってああひそかが来たのか見つかったそうです本当か受け取っておきました While learning about shadow reading from Hisoka, Yuri used the ability to retrieve an album of post-mortem photographs from a ruined inn on Mount Hikami. The album was requested by a certain Ren Hojo. As Ren woke, up, awoke from a bad dream, he found himself tormented by uncertainty. Was it really just a dream, or a suppressed childhood memory? This question has plagued him for some time. And that is the end of... Aww, I got on rank B because I missed so many of the ghosts picture even though I knew they were there. This is the only one where I remember where most of the pictures are. <sighs> I'm so sad. <laughs> the following additional content has been... Passed? <gasps> I can dress... What? You can... The following additional... Beauty... Oh, because I pre-ordered. I can wear a hat? Okay, I want to... How do I do costumes? Can I... Oh. It looks surprisingly wrong on you. <laughs> what? What? Oh, what is this? Oh, but I only have 12,000! Oh, but I want them! <laughs> I'm going to leave her outfit as a normal outfit for now. I want that punk one. But I want... What's this? No. That costs money. I want this. <laughs> oh, I want this. Uh, that is a very pretty hat, but it does not go well with your... What is this? Well... Dang, I need more points. <laughs> I want more points. Anyway, it has been several days since the incident at the inn. Hisoka is out on a case. A young girl comes to the shop and finds a worried Yuri. Yuri is given a missing persons case, something H Hisoka forbade. Uh, wait, does this... Oh. You know what? It's... Oh, what? I have type 14 film? Well, I'm just gonna go with what I... I, I have nothing? I want more points. I don't want less points. I need those outfits. I will do anything for outfits. I love outfits. I love dress-up games. A few days of have passed since Yuri's introduction to shadow reading at the abandoned inn. Since then, Hisoka has gone off somewhere and hasn't returned. Yuri worries for Hisoka, but isn't sure how or where to start searching. As she sits waiting at the antique shop, a girl named Fuyuhi Himino shows up, claiming to have enlisted Hisoka to help her find a missing person. How do I save in this game I don't remember what if I just wanna do I just open the menu and save there's no save spots in this game are there I don't remember I'm s
Man, those teacups are nice. But when would you ever use those? <laughs> also, Yudi looks so sad. Kurosawa, Hisoka san wa irashai masu ka? Ah, sumimasen. Ima lusu ni shiteimasu. Irai o shita Himino desu. Hito sagashi da kara ukeru ka dou ka toyu koto deshita kedo. Itsu ni naru no ka to omotte. Hito sagashi. やまに行ったかもしれないんです。ひかみ山。ひかみ山。山の近くで遥かを見た人がいて。自殺の名称ですよね。<笑> すみません。黒沢が戻り次第。いえ。遅くなるなら結構です。自分で確かめます。あ、あ。The missing person case? Hisoka left a few days ago and hasn't been back. Maybe this is what she's been working on. Hisoka's room is upstairs. Maybe she left some clues as to her whereabouts. Oh my god, I need a better chair. <laughs> Wait, how do I open the menu? I'm so old. Oh, it does not let you save. Yudi, how do I save? Yudi, how do I get out of this car? I'm still boob jiggle. Still nervous about standing here by myself as I've never been good at handling customers. I've only just learned how to make coffee and I've never actually served a customer yet. Uh well same girl. I've never been good at handling customers either. Especially those ones that come in and they This radio has been set out as a decoration. The tuner doesn't work anymore, so it only ever puts out white noise. This is a customer restroom. Anyway, um, never been good at handling customers either, especially the ones that come in and they tell you their life story or they tell you something incredibly sad and I'm like, I'm sorry? Like, how exactly? I don't have a camera. How exactly would you like me to respond? Wow, an old ass P. Wow, what is this white thing? <sighs> respond to that. A book about Mount Hikami was lying on the bookshelf. It seems that, or it seems to be about the rumors surrounding Mount Hikami as a site of spiritual activity. How does a place become famed for suicide? As more people die, the place will gain a reputation, and people are drawn to these spots out of a desire not to be found in the end. Interestingly, these suicide side spots are rarely known as hot spots for spiritual activity. This is what makes Mount Hikami distinct from others. It has both a tradition of suicide and has long been associated with ghost sightings. Then there are the so-called Maidens of Black Water. Title drop. It is said that if you are found by one of those maidens, they will lead you to your death. Those caught in the maiden's gaze will or never again leave the mountain, or so the rumors go. There are also tales of specters on Mount Hikami who relive their own deaths. Those who do not die in accordance with local practices become cursed, forever to re or forced to relive, to relive their final moments for eternity. Many of the people who have been kept from committing suicide on Mount Hikami claim to have been to have seen a maiden or one of those looping specters and have felt a strong compulsion to kill themselves. Perhaps it is because of the stories of maidens and ghosts that the mountain continues to be a popular spot for those take looking to take their own life. Why am I struggling so hard today? 
A book about Mount Hikami was lying on the bookshelf. It seems to be about the tradition surrounding the mountain. Mount Hikami was long, has long been feared to be haunted. In the past, it was said that sleeping with one's face, feet facing the mountain was taboo. Watching the sunset behind the mountain, too, was believed to invite forth beings from the netherworld. Today, the mountain is said to call to those fascinated by death. Countless rumors abound of people spirited away to that accursed peak. They are said to venture to that what? They are said to venture to the mountain alone, leaving behind no trace of themselves. Some say the bodies of those who vanish can be found at the bottom of the lake of the departed on the mountain summit. Since becoming a tourist destination, the prevalence of such frightening tales did see did seem to dis diminish for a while. Even so, despite its fleeting status as a tourist hotspot, Mount Hikami is yet to shake its reputation as a cursed mountain, a place of death. Today, it has become a popular place at which to commit suicide. Also, if you guys did not know, Fatal Frame has a ton of reading, which, as you have noticed, I struggled to do. <laughs> so. Please bear with me while I try and figure out how English works, because English is hard, and so is walking around, it seems, because dear lord, am I crashing into everything. I know it told me where Hisoka's room is, but items. I need to search for items all the time, because I need to hoard all the items gaming mentality. You never know when you might need something. Also, can I walk a little bit faster? Yes, I can. Oh, oh. What is this? What is this door, Yudi? The back door is locked as usual. Okay, it's the back door. What? You... Is this a door? This leads to the bathroom. Hisoka prefers a large bathtub, but it's too large for me to relax in very easily. You have three bathrooms in this house. Is this, this is Yudi's room, I think. Yusuka's room, Yudi's room, Yudi's room, I think. This is, yeah, Hisoka gave me this room when I moved in. It used to be her bedroom. It's been a while since I moved in, but I still haven't unpacked anything. Um, okay, well, this is Yidi's room. This is not the room I was supposed to go in. I need to walk out. E. I went the long way to Hisoka's room, didn't I? <laughs> Boob jiggle. Why? Why was it, why isn't it added feature? Why is there always boob jiggle? Boob jiggle annoys me. This is Hisoka's room. She really likes the traditional Japanese style. I've noticed. An old Japanese full wait, Japanese style full length mirror. I've never looked liked looking into mirrors. Me neither. Can I oh hoping. No, not that door, I meant the drawer. Go back inside, Yudi. There is nothing of interest in here. If you can hear, there's a car farting outside my house. A folder reading, Lost item sits on the desk. Looks like it's bound by string. This seems to, These seem to be notes on Hisoka's shadow reading cases. Client. Item missing item a diary token photo of the deceased details locate mother's diary client seeks info on their late mother relates to a deceased individual apply caution the caretaker of the deceased had burned the diary at her request storeroom key locate storeroom key item may already be lost token and item belong to deceased apply caution item located had been hidden by client client's parent to return to the client diamond ring uh, uh, fiance not to be notified date of wedding <laughs> approaches 
found on client's desk was in an obvious place, but somehow eluded <laughs> the client. <laughs> client Hojo Den or Den Hojo album of postmortem photographs. Photographs reference material for the book about traditional practice in Mount Hikami area. Bad location, but minimal danger anticipated client is an acquaintance. Found in old abandoned building. Wait, in old building of abandoned inn, a shadow attempted to drag Yuri towards the netherworld. Should have gone alone. Must warn Yuri to stay away from the mountain. And yet you went to the mountain. There is a book next to the file entitled The Art of Shadow Reading. Shadow reading is the ability to read traces of the past, not unlike the ability commonly known as psychometry. By following these traces, it is possible to find things that have gone missing or which were no longer visible, things that are demonstrably there but for some reasons unknown are all but invisible. Things the owner wished to be forgotten, things whose owners have passed away, things that no longer wish to be seen, things drawn partial way to the netherworld, invisible within our own. Such things can, or such items can be called back to the world of the living. Unlike these objects, however, people who have been spirited away must not be chased after lightly. In such cases, they have been taken by creatures of the netherworld who linger nearby. Utmost caution must be, must always be applied. Well, we're gonna go dive in head first. Letter from Fuyihi. An open envelope has been left on the desk. The sender's name reads Fuyihi Himino. This must be Fuyihi's missing person request. Maybe it could provide some clues as to where Hisoka and Fuyihi went. They went to the mountain. She said she was going to the mountain. Did you not hear? Dear Miss Kurosawa, please find Haruka. She went missing over a week ago. You do still take on missing persons cases, don't you? I've contacted the police, but they're no help. They say she's probably spirited away. Haruka wouldn't have gone anywhere without telling me. I'm certain something bad has happened. I can handle my own grief, but I can't stand the thought of her suffering somewhere. What if she's waiting for me to find her? I'm worried sick. Haruka is still alive. I know it. But something has to be done and quick. Remember when you found that precious picture of me and Haruka? I was so happy to have it. Now I need your help once again. There's a photograph with the letter. It shows Fuyihi looking shy and another girl. They look close. They're BFFs. Is that the end? <laughs> oh no, this is- we're watching the sunset. Why must we go at night? Can we not go during the day? Like normal people? Why would you visit the mountains at night? Where all the creepy stuff come out? <sighs> Mount Hikami. Fuyuhi is somewhere on this mountain. I should be able to use this picture of her to find her trace. No. How do I save? It's saving. Wait, that's not the trace button. This is the trace button? This is the trace button. It is saving and we are gonna follow that trace in, uh, at another date because it's been a long time and I am struggling with English. So I will be back at a later date when I am braver and we'll find Fuyuhi there. Then maybe, I don't know. Maybe I don't want to find her. Maybe I just want to stand on this bridge with dead weeds? Things. Maybe I don't want to go to the mountain. <laughs> but if you could tell me that you're all there and watching and that I'm not alone in my little tiny bridge on this scary ass mountain. We greatly appreciate it. Please leave a like, subscribe, and comment. Please dear lord comment to let me know that I'm not by myself. I'm not alone. That I have someone with me because I am scarred. And I will see you guys hopefully living 
in the next episode. Bye-bye.